Okay, so how do you think Series 4 compares to Series 3? I think Series 3, obviously, you had to introduce all the characters and stuff, and this year you managed to delve a bit deeper, so it's a little bit darker, I think, and just a bit more in-depth than the last year, really. How would you say it's darker? Um, I'd just say, obviously, you, you kind of deal with the emotions a little bit more and get a, even more deeper into the characters, which you get a few dark, like with Effie's character, her character's a lot kind of deeper and more emotional than last year and stuff, so... What's in store for Pandora? Um, well, last year obviously she cheated on Thomas and she wanted to um, kind of make things right again and I think this year she's trying, she's trying to kind of sort things out and make sure things are still okay and I think she's struggling with that and Thomas is struggling with that and it's whether or not they can resolve their problems and whether she can be forgiven and whether Thomas can deal with that or muck it up basically. So it's, that's still kind of going on in their life. And so he hasn't forgiven her then? Well... I think he wants to forgive her, and I think anyone, if someone's cheated on, on you, you kind of feel, was the relationship kind of mucked up from the start, and was it supposed to happen, and they're young, and should they still be, like, is it just easier whether they're apart, or is it, or are they going to be able to kind of deal with, deal with it, and he can forget, because obviously Cook's always in his face, and it makes things difficult, because he's always reminded that something has happened between Pandora and Cook, so it makes it a lot more difficult for him to get over, but um, hopefully he can, I don't, I don't know. And how are things between Pandora and Cook? They haven't really socialised that much, to be honest. Um, I wouldn't know. <laughs> but um, I think Pandora understands that it was her fault as well. She, I think, and even though Cook um, let everybody spilt, well, spilt the beans about what happened between them, she shouldn't have done it anyway. So I don't think she really, she's annoyed with Cook for telling everyone, but she knows that the truth always comes out, and it's better that it's been come out because now she's not living a lie, and she can get on and move on with what she's done and learn from it because everyone makes mistakes. She made a lot of mistakes in Series 3. She expanded her horizons quite a bit, drugs and drinking and so on. Does that carry on in Series 4? No, I think she's learnt a lot last year. I think last year she needed to experiment a bit because she'd never been given the chance to make any mistakes before because she had her mum on her back going, don't do this, it's wrong. So, But um, I think she needed to break free from that. And because she's made so many mistakes, and um, she's, she's learnt from it and she's trying to be a good person, I think. She doesn't... She, she's trying to fix things, I think, and do what's right. She's got a very clear conscience now, I think. What sort of roles are you hoping for after Skin? I'd really like um, a, to do a period drama. I think that would really interest me. I'd also like kind of a sort of... I don't know, everyone wants kind of a villain or a not-so-nice character because I've obviously got quite an innocent face. I'd quite like to be able to pull off um, someone who looks completely different from how I look, <laughs> which would be quite a challenge, but I'd quite enjoy something like that. And, yeah. OK, and finally then, where do you hope Pandora is at the end of the series? Um, I hope um, she doesn't blame herself too much at the end of the series for what happened last year, and I hope, I kind of want her to just kind of know what, a bit more about what she, who she is and what she wants to do in her life and not feel like she has to follow the crowd and not feel like she's trapped in her mum's sort of little bubble and kind of be a bit more independent and not rely on other people. And I think Thomas kind of not always being there for her or the, the struggles that they might have this year, I think that's going to help her become more independent. So I think that's because she always relied on Effie or Thomas or someone to be there to kind of reassure her that she's doing okay. So I think it'd be good for her to um, just be on her own and be independent in a way.